Now, the push to stop Prince Andrew and Harry filling in for King Charles was gathering steam, meaning the pair could soon be relegated to the sidelines. Let's go live to Seven News at Europe Bureau Chief Hugh Wetfield in London. Hugh, this is basically who comes off the interchange bench when Charles is away, is it? Pretty much, Koshi. So they're called councillors of state. They step in for the king or the monarch uh, when they're sick or overseas. At the moment, right. there's five. The queen consort, Camilla, princes William, Harry, Andrew, and his daughter, Princess Beatrice. Now, obviously, uh, Harry, Andrew, and Beatrice don't carry out royal duties, so they're already out of the picture. But the problem is that these councillors need to work in pairs. So if the king is away with the queen consort at the same time, it leaves just William. Early Earlier in the year, when uh, Charles and William stood in for the Queen, they worked together, so they need a pair of them. It's becoming such an issue, oh. it's been debated in the House of Lords here. Is the government happy to continue with the situation where uh, the uh, councillors of state and regency powers may be exercised by the Duke of York or the Duke of Sussex, one of whom has left public life and one of whom has left the country? <laughs> so is it not time, my lords, for the government to approach the king and see if a sensible amendment can be made to this act? Hmm. OK, Hugh, that's fair enough, isn't it? So, so who could step in to help William? So we're not looking at a situation where Harry and Andrew are going to suffer the indignity of losing this title or another title for Prince Andrew. What is likely going to happen is the pool of councillors is going to be expanded. So Prince Edward and Princess Anne are likely to be called up to the bench from the reserves, even further down right. the line, you'd say. Uh, and they're going to be able to carry out these duties as councillors of state as well. This is all going to happen pretty quickly. The legislation is likely going to go before Parliament, before the end of the year. So it's happening. OK, so allow more people on the bench to rotate through. Sounds exactly. like the AFL. All right, Hugh, thank you.